Fire signs, Leo, Aries, and Sagittarius. Welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. Today, we are going to get an update on how your person feel about you right now. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it may not resonate with each and every one of you. All right, spirits and angels, please show me how does Leo, Aries, and Sagittarius person feel about them right now. Knight of Pentacles in one first at the bottom of the deck. You could be dealing with a Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. Your person feels sorry with the Page of Cups here for not either respecting you, the Empress in one first. Either not respecting you or not seeing your value, your worth. And with the Knight of Swords here, they could be feeling very angry with themselves for not realizing that until now. Um, They also could be feeling that maybe you're upset with them, Knight of Swords here. And they're sorry. Page of Cups is a sorry energy um, for me right now, okay? Depending on the surrounding cards, it feels like a sorry to me. Eight of Wands here is a love first. Yeah. Eight of Wands in my first can indicate maybe both of you may have had a misunderstanding or arguments, um, something to do with communication. I feel like they either, again, roles can be reversed, all right? Either they're upset with the communication. That both of you have had with each other but three of pentacles is here right in the middle of the spread here so that means they would like to work things out with you they would like to compromise they would like to speak with you in the hopes that both of you can solve whatever issues that both of you could be going through right now okay five pentacles here is a love first that means they really would like to return they would like to return to you uh reconcile if they if both of you are separated however if you just you know, eight of wands again can indicate some sort of miscommunication, misunderstanding. But if both of you have been arguing, because it feels a bit angry here with the Knight of Swords, they're sorry for the words that they have said, perhaps, and that uh, to put you through a third party situation if you know for sure you're being put in a third party situation. If that's the case, they're sorry about that and they'd like to fix things with you, okay? So we've got the Nine of Pentacles in reverse and Justice card here and the Seven of Cups. They could be feeling a little bit confused right now or wondering what they should do. But ultimately with the Three of Pentacles again at the heart of the reading, it feels like they would like to fix things even though they really don't know how. <laughs> but the Justice here can indicate, you know, sometimes the Three of Pentacles for me, it's like a counseling a card they could be feeling like maybe going for counseling together or like a couple's th therapy that could work mm. the justice here indicates also marriage for some of you it could mean that both of you are married or that they could be thinking about marrying you or being married to you because not a pentacles here is in love first mm. if you are dealing with someone who has been acting like they're single but actually are not not really wanting to tell everybody that both of you are official. This is very specific, just for some of you. If that's the case, I feel like your person would like to end this singlehood and wanting to be serious with you with the justice. But they're still con contemplating with the Seven of Cups here. They're still trying to, they're still thinking about it. But that's something that they're, they're definitely thinking heavily right now, okay? In regards to making the connection of official or getting married. Hmm. I don't see them talking about it right now, but I feel like they maybe they feel like they need to see with the Three of Pentacles here if things can work out between the two of you. Like if there could be uh, some compromisation, if both of you could compromise. Hmm. Let's see more. Leo, Aries, Sag. So we got the Nine of Pentacles in one verse, the Hierophant in one verse, and the Sun in one verse. Yeah, so they, they're still unclear yet as to how to go about things with you. On the Hierophant in one verse, again, could indicate maybe both of you are separated if you're um, 
either both of you are separated or you could have been married or could be going through the force if that's the case they're not happy about about it they don't want that to happen but the nine of pentacles and what verse indicates them feeling right now right next to the page of cups here that they could only offer you something here with the page of cups um not yet a commitment but they're thinking about it right i feel uh, like with the page of, page of cups and the three of pentacles uh, some reason they feel like both of you will have to say something work something out for real and it's not just talk mm. but they're really unhappy with how things are going between the two of you right now they could also be feeling with the hard fight in reverse that maybe both of you are very different from each other let's see more Leo, Aries and Sag Eight of Cups here is in Rub First. We've got the Nine of Cups in Rub First. They feel stuck. Definitely feel stuck. Stuck on you because we've got the Devil here. That means they, no matter how much they try to re release you, forget about you, move on, they still cannot, okay? Perhaps they also be feeling that currently the connection between the two of you is, isn't the healthiest. And also we've got the Eight of Pentacles, so they're just focusing on their work right now or that they could be working on themselves right now. Or that they feel this connection needs work, right? Because of the devil here. The devil can can indicate so many things, right? It can indicate addiction, abuse, or uh, it could be lying, it could be cheating, it could be somebody being overly possessive, controlling, can be anything, right? But for some way uh, in some way shape or form something is unhealthy within this connection okay so they feel like right now with eight of pentacles perhaps this connection needs work okay before with the nine of cups here and my verse before they are gonna you know put themselves in a situation where they i feel like a person loves you but with the page and the nine of cups in my verse it's like they are afraid to love you more than how much they love you already Okay, let's see more. Got the Five of Cups here in my first. So they're trying to think positive regardless the devil. Regardless how negative the situation could be right now between you and your person. They're still trying to see the glass half full then it is half empty. That means they've been thinking about good things about you about the connection as well as the bad ones with the devil so with the hermit in my first they feel kind of lost right now right so some of them they could be just focusing on their work because they feel like this is the only thing that they have control over and that ace of cups in my first can indicate a delay they feel like they would like to delay offering you love or start over because of the devil here Something needs to be worked out between the two of you. And look at the Three of Pentacles here. They feel like both of you will have to come to an agreement where this is how things are going to be, how someone should behave, or how one should speak to another. Because the Eight of Wands, again, and the Knight of Swords, it can indicate some aggressive words that have been said. It could be you have said, said it to your person, or it could go vice versa. It could be both of you, yeah? But the Nine of Wands here in my verse is your energy. They may be feeling that you're not paying them attention right now. And also we've got the Tower. And also with the Two of Pentacles here, <clears throat> they feel either very indecisive or that they feel that maybe they're trying to guess, they're trying to weigh the pros and cons in regards to you, right? So definitely Five of Cups here in my verse, the Devil, definitely a sense of them, um, looking at the pros and the cons of this connection of course the it's not all cons there's definitely positive stuff as well but they're still juggling with the two of pentacles here with the idea of how to work things out with you if if this is the connection with the three of pentacles here that both of you could be able to see eye to eye and compromise and the tower here can indicate them um awaken to the fact that you know, nobody is perfect because 8 is not a perfect number, right? And 10 is a perfect number. Something about this this reading on uh, Leo, Aries and such. Your person is definitely trying to... 
not expect too much from you but at the same time is willing to work with you right through a pentacle something about it's nobody's perfect no relationships are perfect and perhaps if both of you could see eye to eye on things could compromise could could speak with each other with eight of wands here and figure out the right way with the justice here to treat each each other equally because look at the justice there is a um wing scale here right so treating each other the right way respecting each other it could be in whatever way shape or form through communication or it could be through actions as well with the devil all right leo aries and Sag, this is your reading i hope you resonated if you did please hit like share and subscribe i'm gonna leave you with uh, two videos on the screen right now these videos are from my second channel it's a travel vlog channel if you're interested check it out and also i'll leave you with a playlist on the screen this playlist has all of the readings that i've done for you and for the rest of the signs with different topics and different questions but um these videos are still fresh and new so check it out don't let it go to wa uh, waste click on it scroll all the way down and look for your sign there could be some other important messages for you over there and also Leo, Aries, and Sag, I am open for personal readings. If you would like to book me, my information is in the description box below. And for those of you who like to be notified every time when I post your videos, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button. Alright, take care. Bye.